Welcome to the London Youth Express. I am Renata Leuven and today we want to talk about an encouraging message for all our young people and uh, for our adults as well. And this is the fact that we are alive, that we are alive, includes our eternal right to be happy. Life and happiness are completely connected. They are one. We cannot really live if we are not happy. And we cannot be happy if we do not know ourselves, our purpose in life if we don't have goals and dreams, and if we don't feel loved. We don't have necessarily to feel the love of other people, but we need to feel love. And if we tap into the supernatural source of eternal love, the love of our Creator, then we become independent of the love of people because this love is eternal and this love is perfect. Many young people want to be happy and are always searching to obtain things or uh, do things that would bring happiness and also freedom. Love is a decision. We make the decision to walk in love. And happiness is a decision. It is our decision that we decide we want to be happy. And we want to spend our days in happiness. And the source of happiness is within us. The fact that we are alive means we have been given life with everything that is life. And happiness is life. And peace is life. And justice and goodness and joy and contentment are all life. The whole package belongs to us. So where is the problem? The problem exists because our society has forgotten the truth. Our society has forgotten that real human life happens on the inside. It's on the inside, in our emotions and feelings and imaginations and perceptions, in our supernatural self, that real life flows. It's a deception to believe that our lives happen on the outside or that our lives are being done to us by other people or that our lives just happen to us that we are victims. We are not victims. We are too powerful to be victims. Being alive, the fact that we are alive means and testifies to us that we have been given the right and all we need to be happy and not only 5% happy or 10% happy but 10% happy all the time because the world is wrongly wired and because society exists in a wrong state and this wrong state includes injustice and uh, crimes and um, exploitation and discrimination. We got to set ourselves apart from the general degenerative state of society. And we got to put ourselves into the right state and into the right frame of mind which means we have 
to affirm our happiness daily, every morning when we wake up, throughout the day and in the evening and at night time. It is a decision to be happy. It is our right to be happy. And if we make the decision to be happy, to live lives that are good and happy, then we can rest assured that the universe, the power that is greater than us, God, the supernatural, will empower us to manifest happiness. And this is what we got to see, happy people. We got to see happy people, happy young people. We got to stop seeing young people who are full of hatred because they have been always misunderstood, misrepresented, and uh, oppressed. We got to see happy young people. Young people who say no to unhappiness and boredom. Young people who take control of their lives and who are happy because they made the decision to be happy and who live happy lives. Because it's beautiful and good to live a happy life and to be happy. This is our inalienable right. This belongs to us. It cannot be taken from us. It's only we who can be lacking of knowledge and therefore give this right up. We should never give up our right to be happy, no matter what the circumstances no matter what the situation we are destined to be happy this is our right and that we are alive means that we have the potential and the power and the will to be happy so let us be happy don't let's wait anymore no waiting anymore let's be happy now Let's be happy now, today.